Hey people, uh, sometimes when a man is trying to earn an honest dollar, he's got to face the consequences sooner or later. And yesterday I was hauling a water heater in the back of the truck. Not this water heater, but I had another one that I uh, junked today. Um, I was hauling that water heater and I braked really hard and the water heater slid up and it touched the window and broke my window out. Uh, I know it sucks, but uh, sometimes I gotta face the consequences. I knew it was I knew it was gonna happen sooner or later. And I thought of buying a whole new sliding rear window, but I think I'm just gonna try to fix the old one first. I got this piece of plexiglass here that was laying in the house, and I'm gonna use this uh, plastic piece, which the window uh, slides onto this track, and I'm gonna use this as a template. I'm gonna trace it out like that on the piece of plexiglass and cut the plexiglass out. Uh, cut, cut a piece of plexiglass to fit rather. And yesterday, um, I always keep the doors locked on this thing because uh, I got my stereo in there uh, with the detachable face and remote. So I took the detachable face and remote and put it in the house for a temporary being. So yeah, I'm just gonna try to cut a piece of plexiglass out and uh, if I got a piece to fit, I'm going to uh, glue the tracks. I'm going to take some silicone and I'm going to put it in the tracks and put the piece of glass in there and just let it glue up. Yeah, um, a new new window costs about 40 bucks, but I don't feel like spending that much. <laughs> so yeah, I got a bunch of scrap here today. I've been collecting a lot of scrap. Even though it's summertime, most people throw away their crap in the springtime yep sometimes a man's got to face the consequences I replaced the front brake hose on my car today uh, the brake hose costed me eleven dollars uh, which was a shocker thank god it cost eleven dollars I thought it was gonna cost more than that but that's good and the oil levels fine now I just gotta get a full service spare for the rim in the trunk then I'll be ready to go on vacation. It's another one. Seems like they get worse when I'm trying to make YouTube videos. Here's my garden. Here's a couple pepper plants. Here's a big zucchini plant. There's the cherry tomato plant. And here's, I think this is an early girl and one's a champion. And here's all my cucumbers too. Uh, last week we had cucumber salad, homemade cucumber salad. So uh, yeah, we got the cucumbers going. And I already picked a ripe tomato today to use with our hamburgers. There's a little bit of grass growing in here. Let's wait for this plane to go over. I got a little bit of weedage in here. Um, it's not too bad. What I did in the springtime after I planted was I uh, put a couple layers of newspaper on the ground, then put mulch on the top of it, and that helped to keep the weeds down, and it seems to do a pretty good job, even though I think uh, the newspaper is starting to eat away. But yeah, um, yeah I already picked a big zucchini, so. And that concludes this video. Bye.